Hello everyone. Our today's topic is Power BI reports for Dynamics 365 and Power Apps. In my demo session, I am using Dynamics 365 Sales Hub. Let me click on Opportunities. On the Opportunity Grid, you can see Visualize this view option. With a single click, Power BI will automatically generate a set of visuals for you from any model driven a Power App and Dynamics 365 data which is stored in Dataverse. So whether using any Dynamics app or any model driven app, you will see this option on the grid. Let me click on this. Now you can see a beautiful report is in front of us. Data being visualized within this report is always based on data currently in the grid view. This means if you have applied any filter to grid, filter data will be used in Power BI visuals. So let me click on show data table. So as of now, these visuals are based on this all opportunities grid. Let me close this one. Let me apply a filter. Now we only have three opportunities in grid. Let me visualize the view. Now this report visuals are based on those three opportunities. You can see these three opportunities which are the basis for this report. Let me close this one. Let me clear filter and again open the report. From security perspective, please note that Power BI is connecting to Dynamics on behalf of the user that click the visualize this view. So there are no security issues. So let's play with this report now. On right side you have your data pane. And you can play around. Reports are quite interactive. Let me click on this account. Other parts of reports are modified as per my selection. You can try more options over here like export data. So you can export your data in Excel file. Show as table. Spotlight, get insights and sort access. Under personalization, you can choose type of graph and you can also try few other options as per your business requirement. So you can see with single click you got a powerful Power BI report. Please notice this, this report is temporary and only for you. It will vanish after some time. But if you want to save this report for future use or maybe for sharing purpose, you have to save the report. Now this report is a normal Power BI report. You can modify further as per your requirements. Let me do minor modifications. So if you are expert in Power BI, you can modify this report as per your requirement. 
and you can save and download. Now this report is being loaded in Power BI desktop. Let me run all the background queries. You may modify further and publish after that. Now our report is published and now we can use this report in any of the model driven app. Let me go to power platform environment. Let's create a new solution. In the new solution, let's add existing Power BI report. Our Power BI report and data set is added to solution. In my case, I am using sales app application which is a model driven application and I want to add this report to accounts form. Click on component, add a one column tab. Find component Power BI. Here you can see your report, my opportunities report. As of now, I am keeping all options default. Now, this report is available on the account entity form, which is part of your model driven app sales sub application. Visibility of data is controlled by your security role and your permissions. Click on component. Edit component. You can try different options which are quite intuitive. You can try various options as per your requirement. Now you can see we have action bar, we have filters over here. Let me save and publish. Let's go back to sales of application. Click on accounts. On this account form, now we have new tab, ops report. And now we can see report over here. And data and report is based on your security role. So learn today and how to see a Power BI report from any grid in a model driven app. Or if you want to save the report and you want to use in future for any model driven app, you also learn that. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked it. I will be happy to solve your queries further. Please mention in comment box or over my website which I have given in description. Please subscribe to my channel to see such demonstrations. Thank you.